Here we go, here we go. Let's see what we can find. Oh, that's cool. I always like the baseball players and war cards and stuff like that. Showing athletes who were participated in the war. Seems really special. And any kind of athlete who also served his country is extra cool. No doubt about that. Somehow I got Cy Young and mixed in there. But this is the short print saxophone player, pioneer of Bebop. <laughs> Bebop. <laughs> Here is a numbered one, and that's number two, uh, 150, Robert Johnson. Okay. Bebop. <laughs> Another musician here, Benny Goodman. Marciano, what a boxer he was, huh? Finished his career undefeated. I watched some stuff of him on ESPN Classic. Some of his fights were just epic. Here is a... Uh, okay. Yeah, um revolutionizing some of the ways that we did health care for infants and babies pretty cool all right all right eugenics all right all right what do we have what do we have i think it, yeah the car got stuck back th back in there Edgar Allan Poe, film cell relic. What is it going to be? Billy Crystal and analyze that. 36 of 80. Hmm. Billy Crystal and analyze that. I have to think about, I think he was a psychiatrist or something. Or maybe, um, yeah, I think he was a psychiatrist in that movie. And I think Robert De Niro was in that. Isn't that right? The movie was Robert De Niro seeing a psychiatrist. I could be wrong, but I, I think that's what it was. Yeah, okay. All right. Yeah, I was right. All right. Yeah, that's a pretty good movie. I think I can remember some of the stuff about it. It was pretty cool. Might need to see it again, though. Can't really remember it too well. Okay. More might be worth a rewatch. James Stewart. There he is. Wasn't he part of the Rat Pack? It was initially a failure. Wonderful Life was a failure. Starting off, I did not know that. 
Maybe he wasn't part of the Rat Pack. Maybe I'm getting mixed up with somebody. I thought he was in the Rat Pack. of Sherlock Holmes. So that's our rip in this blaster of famous Americans.